Back again, Enjuk. You've picked up my interest in the beasts of the old world, I see. There you go, Enjuk. That should be the last of the figurines. The blue light. I didn't know if I'd ever see the whole collection reunited. And look at them. They're... beautiful. You've done a great thing, Aloy. These may represent the last record that any of these beasts ever lived. Take this. It's the least I can do. And come back any time. I and our animal friends await your return. That's all I need to know. Are you sure? You can never learn too much. Alsis, Alsis. The Noble Moose. Brought to you by Montana Recreations. The horns grow like trees. Of course, this moose used those bizarre growths to blend in with its forest home. Canis Lupus. The Enigmatic Grey Wolf. Brought to you by Montana Recreations. Could it be that these wolves and our foxes are the same somehow? Perhaps after hundreds of winters. No. No, that's ridiculous. Otocolius virginianus. The majestic mule deer. Brought to you by Montana Recreations. Not built like a predator, but... Perhaps it needed those horns to take down its prey in the absence of sharp fangs. Ursus Arctos, the menacing grizzly bear, brought to you by Montana Recreations. Those claws look like they could wrench someone in half. Perhaps in its youth, but you heard Montana Recreations. He said it's grizzled, old. Its hunting days are behind it. Bison, bison, bison. That's the actual Latin name of the regal American bison. Brought to you by Montana Recreations. Latin? Perhaps that's some sort of old world custom in which one repeats the name of a particularly revered animal. Puma Concalor. The Fearsome Cougar. Brought to you by Montana Recreations. Its coat is sand colored. Could it have been a burrowing animal? Perhaps those teeth were only used for digging. Ursus Americanus. The Magnificent American Black Bear. Brought to you by Montana Recreations. How would you like to find yourself cornered by that thing? I suspect I'd like it very much indeed. What a beautiful beast you were! <laughs>